had lupus, well, her lupus was really like acting up in North Carolina. So like, like she had like these flare ups, joint pains, all that kind of thing. And we were driving back, like she laid on me pretty much the entire way back. And I think that's when like she realized, right, this guy's actually pretty, pretty nice because like he didn't ask, he didn't tell me like, all right, get off my lap or type thing. Like I just let her just rest on me the entire way back. And it was like two and a half hour ride from Myrtle Beach to Charlotte, the Belmont area. But yeah, we just, everything flourished from there. Like in 2011, I, pr I proposed to her over in Ocean Isle Beach. Like that, that was around our anniversary. And um, I did a ride there on the beach at night. And I could tell, I mean, she was extremely tired. And I was like, I just want to do this. I was like, I want to do it like today. And she knew like, like so why are you being so like persistent to get me like out here right now? I was like, oh, just, let's, let's just go out to the beach. It's a nice night. I proposed to her on the beach, said yes, and everybody was, Right, like static and everything, and she she loves. She's very organized. She's like OCD about like organization, putting things like like we saw like the pantry. She like, everything's just like named in a container all the way down. Like it's very easy for if you just came into our house, you would you would know what stuff was. You would know like where everything was. It would be easy. So like everything was just she was planning the way. Everything was great, and then 2012. She were here, but she was planning the wedding from here. But everybody was back in North Carolina. Mm -hmm. But it was a guess you call it destination wedding if you want, because I fly back for that. But we got married in it's like the Double Tree Hilton Hotel that was there. It was like in their court. It was in November, and it was underneath one of the big tents and everything. It was beautiful, and it, went, it was it was it was amazing. And we went to Myrtle Beach for the for the honeymoon. And then 2013, in December 17th, that's when Bella was born. Like, we've been trying for a while and nothing was happening as far as getting pregnant or whatnot. And she's, well, thing <laughs> was, she said, so since we're not getting pregnant, since it's not happening, like, I'm going to buy a supercharger for your car. I'm like, okay. And then it turned out that weekend we conceived Bella. Oh, yeah. So that week she bought me a supercharger for my car. So it was Did you take that back? I don't even put it on. <laughs> and it was actually like a special order like part that was hitting another dealership. Okay. So like that. So like it was it was ironic that it happened that, you know, like bought a supercharger for my car and then that would be getting confused about them. And then um Bella was just a gift. I mean a, a, she didn't think she could she could get pregnant because of the lupus and everything like that. Like the doctor said it could happen, it might not, but it happened and it was it was a blessing in the skies right there. It's like, oh my goodness, this happened, you know? <laughs>